that's one of the great things about um, not worrying about a PG-13 rating. I've done so many films in that. In, in this case, politicians have scandal. They have sex scandals, and they speak, you know, when they're off camera, very colorfully. <laughs> so we wanted to um, give, especially Will Ferrell's character, a chance to ar articulate his uh, his, you know, his um, what's the right word? His <laughs> his uh, his craziness, you know, with colorful language. So um, we we decided to also we wanted there to be scandals that reflected the way they work in real life. There have been cases of people tweeting pictures of their body parts and there have been cases of, of uh, both celebrities and politicians leaving incredibly obscene messages on people's answering machines by mistake. So we just didn't want to water that down. And once they, once they have that, they, they, they don't have any trouble <laughs> going off. And, uh, and, and, you know, we'd never go too far. Um, the only time we, we uh, might have almost crossed the line is that we did an entire scene... Uh, with Dylan McDermott in fully nude, <laughs> and um, <laughs> I like your face when you saw that. Uh, yeah, he uh, he did a scene when he was in uh, Cam's house after he had dumped Marty and wasn't organizing his campaign anymore. Where Marty comes to visit uh, Cam, and the way he finds out that um, Will Ferrell's character is being taken care of by by Dylan McDermott's character is Dylan walks out of the shower stark naked and has a normal conversation. And he's, he's, he's actually doing it to mess with Marty's head because Marty's so uncomfortable and has, you know, has some sort of sexual identity issues anyway. So uh, it, was, um, it was a great and very shocking thing, but we uh, decided to, um, to cut it in the long run, mostly because it was tied to another story element, but it might have, it might have, um, it might have been a very, very striking moment. <laughs> it might have been what people were talking about. It probably should be a very special DVD release of its own, all on, on its own. A special <laughs> viral uh, um, clip that uh, I don't know where it would be allowed to be, but uh, yeah, no, it was, it's impressive. He's an impressive guy. He looks, he looks amazing. I mostly just try to create a situation where they can feel free to try anything. And we shoot so much footage and they trust me that I let them come into the editing room and have some say on how it's cut together so they know they can play in any, any amount they want. Uh, and then I, I really just try to stay out of the way. And I also, my other favorite thing to do is to throw into the mix excellent secondary performers, you know, tertiary, you know the, the other one or two line people are often great, you know, like the guy in the Rainbow Land debate who uh, jumps up and says, I'm an American, I'm not going to go to Rainbow Land, you know, where Zach's accused Will of writing a communist manifesto about the Rainbow Land and the pot of gold that was shared among the elves, you know, or some ridiculous thing. So that guy threw a wild card into that scene in that debate that changed everything and made it really fun. So that's what I, that's my job is to cast the rest of the movie f to create trouble for these guys. That happens all the time. My favorite example is um, in the film, it's uh, common practice in, for politicians to accuse each other of not being religious enough to deserve to be in office. So. Zach accuses Will of not being religious enough, not going to church. Will says, I go to church all the time. And Zach says, well, then say the Lord's Prayer. And it's a trap. Will doesn't know the Lord's Prayer. And Jason Sudeikis feeds the words to him by sign language from the back of the room. Well, he gets them all wrong. And Jason works harder and makes more and more ridiculous sign language to, to uh, help him through it. And they improvise that entire thing. And it, ch it changed the feel of that whole scene and also got us you know, five or six big laughs uh, in the middle of a, a scene that we didn't see coming.